Say, hey, guess what, guys? I'm, uh, I'm making another movie. <laughs> oh, yes, oh, the fake blood. Apparently, you're supposed to present as feminine or masculine. Well, I'm presenting is fucking idiots. Why did we stop drawing ridiculous looking sea monsters on our maps after we chartered the world's oceans? What did you do to my boys? Um, the hell is your screen name? When you meet a new group of people and everyone starts sharing their pronouns, call that a PRONOUN HOLDDOWN! Holy shit, guys! The producer of the Scooby-Doo movie's named... Dick Suckles! Yo, guess what year he was born in, pal? January 1969! I don't know what energy it is, but the whole movie just radiates something forbidden. Who else is in the mood to walk barefoot over the moors in a blood-red velvet ball gown, with anguish in your soul and wet leaves in your hair, while the wind blows moodily and dramatically? Can we all get McDonald's afterwards? We all deserve it, so yes, absolutely, my treat. Year 3000. Naruto is dead. Zaruto, the son of Paruto, who is the son of Karuto, who is the son of Goruto, who is the son of Boruto, who is the son of Naruto, now has an anime. Mm -hmm. Zaruto is gonna be better than Paruto. Kishimoto assures at age 1026. Jesus. <laughs> Fucking Christ. I honestly can't deal with secondhand embarrassment in TV shows or movies very well. I like literally pause it, internally scream, and come back in like 10 years. Let me just say, I've owned a Rift for two years, thinking it's supposed to look that blurry, but I guess you gotta wear glasses even in virtual reality. Today I shoved my glasses into the headset, and it's like seeing VR for the first time, brownie face. I thought VR was just bad. Oh, Pucky. You poor innocent soul. Fun Christmas idea! Hang mistletoe, but instead of kissing you, you have to fight whoever else is underneath it! Call it mistletoe. Someone's halls are getting dirked! Listen, bro, not to sound like a fucking wuss or anything, but, like, kitchen appliances are dope. No, listen, dude, I know you think that's girl shit, but think about it. You can use tongs to easily pick up chicken. You can flip them on the other side and get an evenly cooked filet. Wait, listen, bro, 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 bro. You can get a spice drawer so you can organize and experiment with different kinds of spices. You can get a non-stick pan so you don't even have to worry about that shit sticking. Like, bro, bro, fucking come on, man. Live it up. Teaching kindergarten is like being an ambassador to beings from another planet and teaching them how to assimilate to our culture. No, we do not lick water fountains. Perhaps that's acceptable on your planet, but here on Earth, we prefer to drink from water fountains. Physics might be a little different on your planet, but here when you throw things, they typically fall and break. Grabbing people and shaking them violently is not considered a public greeting on this planet. This... this is real. Yo. Shout out to the trans girl that called her estrogen pills titty skittles. I appreciated that greatly, and it was the funniest thing I've heard all year. When the back of my neck gets tickled. Jesus, what the fuck happened to that plane? It got tickled on the back of its neck, like you just said. Another day down. Till the next fun surprise. That sounds like a threat. Ugh, not everything I say is a threat. But this is. When a bard uses vicious mockery, what they say comes out sounding incomprehensibly bass boosted, and that's how it causes physical damage. Oh, listen up, you fucking. It is time to cleanse your mind with Sean. My Tumblr. Wars have progressed from attacking information to attacking information. Sleepwalking is the body's charging your phone while you use it. Opening the task manager is like snitching to the teacher. Magically everyone starts working again instead of messing around. Cowboys riding off into the sunset picked a really bad time to start a journey. People with depression can be some of the most chill and nicest human beings you'll ever meet. Take note. If you raise and care for chickens, you are a chicken tender. Never give up on something you really want. It's difficult to wait, but worse to regret. Flaming swords are often depicted as being a better weapon than a normal sword, but it would actually just cauterize the wound, making it less lethal. Pacifists, take note. You can make the same exact dish mom makes for dinner and follow the same instructions. And for some damn reason, mom's food is better. The voice in your head is the real you. 
Every other version of you displayed is a facade the real you made up to do with others. And finally, if in the movie Cars, the characters are to be seen as real characters, the crash scenes are pretty fucking brutal for kids to see. And this has been by Tumblr. What up, my nut sluts? Um, they're called vampires. I name thee Dragon Master 69. Sir, this is your newborn child. I said what I said. Wait, hold up. Was that a was that a supernatural reference? <laughs> nice secret forbidden bloodline technique, idiot. Your dad get that for you? No, my mom did, idiot. <laughs> Look at this loser. Their mom still picks out their finishing moves for them. <laughs> You're right, I'm a pirate. Swab the deck so you can pay for your student tuition. There's absolutely no way your janky ass pirate paycheck can help me pay my student tuitions. Yo! $22 an hour plus a tuition assistance program. Oh fuck, sign me up, I'll be a pirate. Y'all ever just have the overwhelming urge to swim? Not like actively, but you just want to be in the water and have some peace. That's how it gets you. That's... It's so fucking ominous. Am I gonna die? Head empty, just bees buzzing. Call that a hive mind. HOW DARE YOU BE FUNNIER THAN ME! Donald Trump's cake was 90% styrofoam. I guess you could say the cake was a lie. Am I right, gamers? Hey, 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 gamers, am I right? No one answer him. Let him suffer. The snack that claps the fuck back. Goldfish! Finally, a weapon to surpass Middle Gear. Yo, is this a new weapon in Ruby? You know, if it wasn't for that caption, I would have said the same fucking thing. Why do people think fog is so scary? It's literally like clouds came down to hug the earth. That's cute! Have you ever played Silent Hill, mate? The only way to destroy Disney is tricking them into buying Tumblr. But then, how will people be able to watch The Mandalorian with Baby Yoda, aka 2019's last meme trend? Oh, I'm sorry, that saltiness come out loud? Today I learned that in 2013, a scientist injected human brain cells into a mouse brain, which improved the mouse's memory and capacity to learn. To stop it from conquering the planet, they injected human brain cells from an incompetent weirdo into a separate mouse, and then put the two mice in the same cage so the silly mouse will always frustrate the terrifying genius mouse's plans. I wonder what they're doing tonight. The same thing they do every night. This Justin, eating fruit is okay! Uh, what's your source? This! Dude, nobody panic. That banana is holding her hostage! The Beatles, not a single song in a Bionicle commercial. The All-American Rejects has a song in a Bionicle commercial. Pretty clear to me who comes out on top. The Beatles? Definitely the Beatles. Wrong! Uh, explain? Ugh. <clears throat> The Beatles, not a single song in a Bionicle commercial. The All-American Rejects has a song in a Bionicle commercial. Any questions? They call me a snack because I'm covered in maple syrup and they can never catch me. It is a phase, Mom. Show me a permanent state of the self, Mom. Impermeance does not mean insignificance, Mom. The key to a happier life is being in a constant state of change and acceptance, Mom. Do you ever wonder about how an author would describe you in a novel? Not only your appearance, but the way you talk and laugh and hold yourself and all the expressions on your face. And then there's this asshole. The Pacific Ocean is wider than the moon. Anyway, how's your day going? Dip moon like cookie. Guys, this anime Mona Lisa is in my library. Help me. Aw, it's the Mona Lisa. By the great artist Leonardo Dojinshi. <laughs> Fucking broken, man. God damn it. Are we doing another Ask Sienna video today? Actually, Cyan, this is, uh, this one's for you. Wait, what? Um, okay. Okay, is anger issues and a non-sharp balisong knife a good mix? I'm honestly asking for myself. It's definitely not a good mix if you want to go to jail at such a young age. I must inquire, what is the maximum velocity of which Cyan is able to travel on foot? Well, take the distance between Pat and Eris' house is 10 kilometers, and you want me there in less than a minute on foot. So my maximal velocity will be 16.67 meters a second, as a normal human has 1.4 meters a second, and 2.5 is their maximum velocity. For those who didn't get that, the boy is fast. Oh, hey, it's Robo Travis. Uh, wh who's Travis? <sighs> Eris. So, how did you pass the I'm a human verification on Tumblr? 
All I did is click I'm not a robot and followed simple instructions. Aris taught him how to do that. Shush you! Put up the photo evidence. Oh my god. So if Pat is fueled by coffee and a cute robot, I can only imagine what Aris is fueled by. She gets fueled by rage and the satisfactory of the deaths and misery of her enemies. Hardcore. Hey, Cyan, I'm tired but stubborn. Any good coffee recommendations? Five shots of espresso. Or as Pat would probably call it, the morning cup. <laughs> Opinions on Ska? What's a Ska? <sighs> Zion, what is your most powerful body part? Could have worded that better. Is it your arms, your fists, your legs, or your brain? Because knowledge is pa powerful body part. Oh, my smile. Seems that every time I do it, it has this effect of making people happy and or fluster. I'm really pissed at the people in the locker room at my school. The things they say are just really gross and LGBT phobic. I feel like I'm gonna snap one of these days. Here's the thing. We can't change the minds of people if they're too close-minded. Just know that you're one of the most understanding and open-minded people who understands the struggles the LGBT community has. Just ignore them and carry on your day. Can we have an epic anime-style robot fight between Cyan and Sienna? Does playing rock, paper, scissors with epic music in the background count? Yeah, this is actually pretty freaking good.